Good morning, friends. It's Sammy back with another version of the Daily Dash. That's right, it's everything you need to know from around the world and in my life, straight from my car dashboard to yours. Don't worry, I'm not driving. Here with my friend Linda, who is graciously driving back from Dollywood Insiders. More on that in just a second, but today is, hey Brenna, today is Friday, April 28th, 2017. I can't do my Friday dance because I got a hold of my camera. Yes, we got to do a little Friday jig. There we go. All right, let me tell you what you need to know so you're in the know around the water cooler and in Carline today. All right, and I forgot to look back at my knees, but I can tell you we are on the eve of President Trump. That's still funny to say. President Trump's 100 days in office. Uh, what else is going on? I know the NFL draft happened last night and some baby stole the show. One of the guys, I can't remember his name for the life of me, brought his baby on stage. How sweet is that right um what else linda anything else that, we're kind of like in dollywood we're news. in a little bit of a, we're in yeah. a little bit of a you know dollywood bubble this week but as i said my beautiful brenna will always post anything you may have missed below you can catch up on sammycone.com follow me on social media at the sammy cone or watch this in its entirety on youtube so let's get to the fun stuff we woo -woo, have been at dollywood for the past two ish days right yes. um, as part of the Dollywood insiders and social media influencers event so basically what that means is that Dollywood has provided us with uh, season pass passes graciously to share about our wonderful experiences at Dollywood so we got to go this weekend we got to preview the new tailspin racer new water slide as you saw yesterday um, drop line is coming up there's another family friendly roller coaster I did, we did, lightning rod for the we first time. Did. Yes. Don't think we'll be doing it again. No. You made me sit by myself. We did. It was awesome. I, I screamed my, this is probably why I'm clearing my throat. Like I screamed like crazy the whole time. World's fastest launching wooden roller coaster, 73 miles per hour. It's crazy town. Let's just say it's crazy no, town. No, it's like nothing else we I've ever been on. Because no. it's a wooden roller coaster, but it has like the feel of a, of a. Like a. Yeah, those like super intense. It's really smooth for like yes. you would never know it's a wooden roller coaster. But it's as fast as I feel like I've ever gone ever. Right. Ever. So if you're a coaster, like we had some people there that were coaster fanatics, like travel the country doing coasters. They said it was like their favorite coaster ever. Um, I think yeah. there's 20 seconds of airtime, like legit, you're out of your seat. Like just let's not even talk about it anymore. That it was, was a intense. little bit much. Was okay. So we did that. Now it rained, and there's another if you didn't catch me on Facebook yesterday there's a video about what you can do at Dollywood when it rains that Miss Linda and our friends Katie and Jennifer contributed to, or Karen food, sorry food, food, food is so good there um, one of the reasons we love staying at the dream War resort because there's a free shuttle you can just hop back to the hotel if you need to wait for the rain to die down that was great when we came back we went into Dolly's closet not her actual closet. I thought it was going to be at her actual closet. We, thought, we kind of were hoping. Um, there's a shop at Dollywood called Dolly's Closet. Now, I have never, I'll admit, I've never stepped foot in it because I thought Terrifying. just sparkly gowns, right, for us to look at. No, it's a legitimate store with super cute, I mean, I'll, I'll admit, I mean, there's things in there I wouldn't wear, I'm not going to lie. No, but it had everything. Every, like, yes. there was country western, there was the road, like, section, there was a black and white section. There was, yeah. So you got a bracelet. I got a bracelet. I got super cute booties for, like, under $50. And this isn't, I mean, I got yeah. leggings yeah. for, like, $10. No, I mean. It was, like, dress up all the way through to comfort. Yeah. Like, all different styles. Purses. Yes. Everything. Now, I will say, if you, again, follow me on Instagram, which I think you should go and vote on which outfit you think I should have gotten. The fringe suede jacket, that was $399. Sure. Obviously, that. Is not coming home with me but the rest was fun and fabulous so we're on the way home right now thankful that Linda is driving not a problem Messy, because all. if you remember this was the exact time last year that I had my TIA and it was after this trip and this drive and so this is the one thing for those of you that had asked I really feel great um, I mean, relatively speaking besides like the food baby that I've got going on right now from my weekend at Dollywood but the only residual thing from that is I don't like driving. Like I just have trouble knowing which exit to get off of. My mind gets jumbled. So I'm very grateful for my friend here doing that. No, okay, I'm this is way longer than it should have been. But I've got Linda. Follow her at Unboxed Mom. You. you will 
not regret it. Such a wise, fun person. Okay, that's it. I hope you guys have a great weekend wherever you are. Make sure you make it great, and don't forget to tell someone you love how you feel about them. Bye, friends.